Seth here from macOS10screencast.com. In this screencast I'm focusing on forklifts, web editing features or features that may be handy or nifty, neat for web editors. In my case I want to write a blog post on our web page at macOS10screencast.com and I already use forklift to upload the picture files or better the back end of WordPress. I just go to this picture here on the left it will download on the bottom and I can go to the menu and click here this menu item copy URL to clipboard. This will set my picture to the clipboard the URL of the picture to the clipboard and then when I preview this blog post you'll see that now we have a little nice image in our blog, blog post. This is enabled when you go to the edit tab on your FTP account, go to the options and there you find two text fields. The one is called base URL the other one is called base path. You really should take care how you set your paths in these two text fields because Forklift can generates the URL of your picture or your file. You select and then copy to the clipboard by these two text fields. In my case I'm on a Linux server on DreamHost therefore my home folder is slash home slash my username and from there I have all my different websites in the root folder so uh, for example macOS 10 screencasts is in slash home slash z slash macOS 10 screencasts dot com and I won't need this to enter here because this folder is named like the domain and therefore I don't have to make any adjustments in the base URL section here. Just click the save button and from now on everything I am editing on this web server from this connection I just click the red mouse button and from here I select copy URL to clipboard. You may already have recognized that I have set a special uh, shortcut for this action because I'm using it so much I use it almost 20 times a day. Just go to the preferences and in the shortcuts pane you will find the edit list. Here is copy URL to clipboard. Just double click the second column and here I have set this shortcut to be option command C and from now on whenever I want to copy a URL from a picture to the clipboard I just hit option command C and I... oh what's that? Whoa, better. And from now on I'm safe to insert whatever picture I want to insert. Let's focus on another feature Forklift is able to handle very easily. I have on my other blog page which is, which is at cettt.com I have a posting where I'm presenting my favorite Macintosh applications and in the list for sure Forklift is but I've found that NetNewsWire is not in the list. No problem we will just go to you we will just go to netnewswire.app, click show package contents, contents, resources, and from here we have this app icon. We'll open that one with preview. And we will use the 3232. 32. Oh, this one's too big. Representation of this icon. Open it again with um, preview, name it, net news wire. The format should be PNG, save. And we can now go back to the desktop. And <coughs> let's say we want to upload a lot of images to the web. Therefore, we could use this sync feature. Let's assume I have already I have already a folder with several icons in them and let's say you, you, could, you can be sure I have uploaded all the pictures on the right with this feature for the purpose of this screencast we will use only one 
just click sync this will bring up the sync menu and here I just hit sync this will take a, a few seconds and then, I, and then I have my netnewswire.png on the list I then can go back to my blog editor and paste the web URL there okay this was it for the screencast I hope you enjoy our website see you again in the future bye